What is up everybody on YouTube? It's your boy Vidigo Vibes here coming at you again with another video. This video we're going to show you today the key pieces over here we have lined up of the outfit. If you haven't already checked it out, please go ahead and click the link below. Here we have six key pieces. So without further ado, let's get into it. This first piece we have here is an elongated black tee by a brand called Claude Morse. This is my favorite black tee to wear on the daily. Now this brand Claude Morse is unfortunately closing down. They made a status about two weeks ago saying they were closing down so everything was going to be on sale. I got this one on sale. This was originally on 120 down on Brunswick Street. Now you probably can get this. I'm not quite sure yet. I paid $6 for this and the quality on this is amazing. I mean if you feel it here, it is one of the thinnest tees in comparison to the ADYN that I have here. So beginning off we have this in an elongated fit and I'm about 171 centimeters for you guys. Um, and this fits pretty long. As you can see at the back, it, it does drop at the back, almost like a drop tail kind of thing. Um, the drop goes pretty long. I mean, it goes probably just the back of my knees, whereas the front probably drops to about two inches above my knee. So this is one of the best layering pieces you could find on the market. You have stitching across here and along down here along the side, and it is a twisted seam. So the side actually comes inside the garments. Turning on the back, we have almost like a T stitch here. So one along here and one across down. And the best thing about this is this is raw hems. So they cut the ends off and then stitch it and it gives it a bit of a roll and a frame, which is really, really cool. So one quick thing about sizing, I seriously think these fit pretty slim. They're very narrow. I'm usually, in between a large and extra large. I went to a double XL on this, and that's why it's pretty, pretty long. But I mean, if you want it to be a bit of a slim fitting garment, you go to your true size. If you want that elongated oversized fit, definitely go up one size, all right? So there you guys go. All right, my second piece, which was underneath the first T, is the 80YN long sleeve. I mean, I've already showed this in my first video. If you haven't already seen it, go ahead and check it out. As you can see by the piece, longer arms, gives you stack on the arm. I've already mentioned this before. So I'm not gonna go into too much detail. Oversized fit, this is a size large for you guys. So not much else to say. So there you guys go. My third piece that I'm showing off to you today is this spray bomber by a brand called Dr. Denim Jean Makers. Getting into it, this is almost like a spray jacket material, but it's in the design of a bomber. So, I mean, I went out on the night, I went to actually go see Kanye, shout out to Kanye. I went, and got, I went and saw him and on the way there it was raining when I was running to the station. And I didn't know this at the time when I bought it, but when I wore it and I was running outside in the rain, I got on the train and you just see all these dots of water speckles. And all I did was just brush it off and it just came off and I was like, oh, well this is waterproof. So, I mean, getting into details, you see the tag right here, I'll get some B-roll on that. This is a size large. You have two pockets in here. YKK zip going down on the inside. It's just satin lining and you've also got one inside pocket here and on the opposite side of the jackets. This is, it's a good jacket. I can recommend it. It's one of the best for layering if you want to chuck in a hoodie underneath it, anything like that. For my outfit, I put on the 80YN underneath the Claude Morse tee, which gave that double laying effect and I threw this on top and it gave that perfect layering that you guys want for the fall that's coming in Australia. So I can really, really recommend this. I picked it up at my local General Pants down in Melbourne CBD. This was on sale, so maybe it might be sold out. i would probably check the website. And this was a size large. This retailed for 180 and I picked it up for 90 bucks. So steal guys, steal. So without further ado, let's get on to the next piece. All right, the pants that I'm showing up for you today is a pair of Subi denim. Now, everyone, and if you don't know, Subi is one of the best companies on the market when it comes to tapering and denim in general. Um, this is a pair of Chich OD Jet Black denim. There is distressing, which doesn't come like that. I distress these myself. I put, will put out a future video and guys how to do that. It's very, very easy. These are a size 36 and I Personally, thought they were pretty baggy. I mean, I really, really wanted that tapered look that's currently in trend right now. So what I did was I went to a tailor, got these tapered. It is pretty small. I think it's about five inch opening, almost four, four and a half inch opening. And that gives you that perfect stacking from here below, which is really, really good. 
we've got the Subi sign right there, Subi label right there. You can see that stacking that goes behind the knee, which is really, really good. If you want to get them tailored and get that stacking, we really recommend it. Um, other than that, it's just a really good pair of denim. Quick story on how I got this. I was on eBay and a, this person was selling this pair in a size 36 for $25. It was a starting bid. And what I did was I quickly just hit him up straight away. I asked, oh, will you take 35 shipped? He's like, yep, done deal. Send him out tomorrow. Sending the money straight away. These came in two days. And I mean, I these were used, but when I got them, they were still in really, really good condition. What I did was I washed them when I got them, got rid of all the dirty stuff that, you know, might have been worn, I guess. I don't know. So I washed them, got them tailored to my preferred fit and ended up paying 35 bucks for a pair of jeans that retail for about 150 bucks. Steel, guys, massive steel. Come on. Always check your eBay for steals like this. On to the next piece. The fourth piece I'm showing off for you today, guys, is this wide brim fedora by a brand called Glory. Now, it says Glory, but when you look it up, it says Glorin for some reason. I don't know why. I picked this up on Urban Outfitters online. I paid 55 ships for this to my house in two weeks, which is pretty slow for Urban Outfitters, but I mean, it's understandable. I get a lot of looks in this hat. I mean, it's like, oh, get yeah, like the people passing, like, what the hell? Why is he wearing that? But I seriously think this goes with anything. I mean, anyone can pull this off, seriously. This is a size large, extra large, and I have a massive head. All my friends tell me, look, man, you got a big ass head. And yeah, I agree with them. I'll leave a link below where you can find these. All right, so there you guys and go. I'll leave the best for last, because this is my favorite sneaker of all time. You have the Air Jordan 1 breads. Now this is amazing, it is this is the best silhouette that you can wear on the daily in any outfit whatsoever. Now these are the DMP pack from 2009. I'm usually 11 in Jordan, so I ended up picking these up and they fit perfect. I got these on eBay. I I mean, I did pay an all right price. I, I don't know, I, just, I was in the moment, I was hunting these down for ages and so I thought, man, I might as well just buy them, so. I got these on eBay. Um, I paid, and yeah, I'm not gonna say how much I paid. I did pay quite a bit, but these are the DMPs, and I, I didn't have the I didn't have enough money to grab the 2013s or the 01s. So I thought, just who cares, man? I had the money. Let's just grab them straight away because this was my favorite sneaker of all time right now. So there you guys go. All right, that's the end of the video, you guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed these this show off that I did of my previous outfit. If you haven't already, go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe, and please check out the previous video on this outfit that I did, this outfit of the day, where I show off all these key pieces. I will leave links down below, all right, of these pieces if you can find them. All right, have you, I hope you guys had a good new year. 2015 is gonna be one heck of a year. Um, I've got a lot of goals and future content that I really wanna get out to you guys. There is, if all my best friends, my mates know that there is one thing I'm really looking forward to getting in February. If you guys know me, you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. All right, so without further ado, I'm gonna head off. Gotta go to work soon, so eh, it's pretty crap, but oh well. So, thanks guys for watching. Peace.